Hi, hi. Hello, hello. We are playing more Pokemon. Um, you'll notice a few things have changed since the end of the last video. Uh, this is because I had a friend over a bit ago, and he played some. Without my permission, without asking, I just saw him playing Pokemon. But, you know, I, I wouldn't have cared too much. He, he told me that he had caught a few Pokemon, he had fought some people, he left the cave. He told me that he thought he had fought my rival, and I was like, oh, okay, sure, whatever, fight Hop. But apparently, he fought the, the kid in the puffy pink coat. I wanted to fight him, I wanted to see what was up with him. Also, uh, my Raphael evolved into a, what looks like called? A Corvusquire. So, you know, my friend only played for like five minutes. <laughs> And already it was a much more exciting episode than uh, the vast majority of the episodes that we've set out so far. Sure, thanks. Alright, let's 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 head into the city. Let's look at the clothing. Let's slow this progress down a little bit. Evolutions and new character battles and... We, we should be spending a whole episode on shaking a tree, IMO. And Oran Berry. Okay. Wait, what is this? Is this some sort of like, if I get too greedy, I'll lose it all? Is there a downside to just keep shaking it? I'm just gonna keep shaking it. Let's shake it a little more. Uh, <laughs> I really don't understand how this works. I guess we'll shake it some more? Is it gonna be like a Pokemon came up and ate all of the berries? Shake it more? Ah, I see, I see. I was close. I don't know. Oh, yeah, he was he was playing with Jeremy. He said Jeremy just demolished everybody. Good job, Jeremy. Uh, missed out a little bit on my Pokemon's progress. Oh, well. I'm mostly disappointed that I didn't get to see the, the one rival fight. I, I guess not really your rival. Hop is, like, your primary rival. This character seems more antagonistic. The rivals these days, they're pretty much just your friends. Like, <laughs> we're far, far away from the days of Gary Oak or Silver, who was... Ah! So, well, we still got a ton of berries. I, I don't know. I don't really get how that works, but whatever. Oh, there's a little Pikachu kit. Alright, this is very pretty. Oh, an Electric. Sure. Try to catch you. Pretty cool mon. Ah, still Jeremy is out. A Jeremy may just... I don't know, the level's pretty high. Jeremy shouldn't one-hit the Electrike. Ah, not bad. Um, I don't see any point in hitting again. I feel like I can catch here. I learned something recently, which I think is really weird. In this game, apparently, your catch chance is partially determined by the level of your active Pokémon. The higher level Pokémon you have out, the more likely you are to succeed in catching. Isn't that weird? <laughs> like, why? What, what is the point of that? Um, now it leads to awkward situations where you want, like, your weak Pokémon out, so that you don't one-shot the Pokémon you're trying to kill, and then you switch to, like, your level 100, who just sits there and tanks while you throw balls. Seems a little weird, but... Sure, I mean, nothing, none of this matters that much. If it was something there from the start, I'm gonna call this one Vespa. I think that's a good name for Electric. See, it's a little, little joke. Um, yeah, I think this is something that if it was there from the start, I wouldn't think twice about it. But the fact that they changed it now just seems weird to me. Uh, let's get Jeremy out of there. It's just a little too strong. He's pulling ahead in level. Uh, let's, let's get Yui. See what she can do against this trainer. Gonna, gonna notice me? Oh! Oh! Ah! It's a Galera Meow! These things are so weird. This is like one of the weirdest Pokemon designs. It's like they... I don't know. Pokemon, I think, has been trending more towards 
Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should have used Tackle. Tackle is stronger. Pokemon designs, I think, have been trending away from this dire uh, direction generally into more kind of like... I, I don't know how to describe this. More of like a... Uh, a character type design, um, something that could not very effective. What what typing is this meowth? Hmm, Yuri's not gonna really do a good job here. Let's send in uh, Armageddon maybe. Um, so yeah, it seems like Pokemon are more kind of personed now. They typically have kind of. Like, I mean, this Meowth has, like, a bipedal body, but it just seems so... I don't know. <laughs> Deranged, I guess? It's, like, very classic. They took a Pokémon that already had this sort of very exaggerated design. Oh. It's super effective. What? What typing is this? What typing did that have? I genuinely don't know. Oh, Jeremy getting stronger. Screech. Ah, oh, we don't need to learn Screech. Hmm. Why did I pick up money? Did someone use payday? Uh. Oh, oh, oh. Jeez, I'm getting so distracted. I forgot. I saw this. Energy powder. That, like, lowers happiness but raises HP. Sure, let's check out your camp. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know. The gla the Galleon mouth Meowth design is so funny. What? Muna floats? Muna. Come over here. You can, you can float. Oh, it's a Pikachu! What is what is that thing? That's a cutie fly. And that's a swooper or something? A Woobat? <laughs> oh, excuse me. But what is this thing? What is this cream colored thing? This must be a new Pokemon. Ooh, a Bronzong is back there? Ah, oh, so cute. So relaxing. Hey, there's an Eevee? Hello, Eevee. Excuse me? No. What's what's going on here? Who are you? No. Uh oh yeah, I'm gonna call Pokemon. Oh what the heck? I'm just talking But she's not the owner of this camp. She's just like here for some reason. Here's the camp's owner. Oh chat with trainer. Oh cool. Huh. But you can see their nature on the stat screen, right? Like, it's not like this is the only way to find out. I don't know. It's whatever. It's it's very strange, but whatever. Where's Yuri? I should talk to Yuri while I'm here. Hello. <gasps> yeah. Hi. Hello. Of course you, you enjoy camping. Let's chat. Then to go, let's play. Mm. Hey. Oh, shake faster. Nice. Faster. Yeah, get attack. Oh, you're attacking too, huh? You think I can't shake you both off? All right, all right. I didn't even see the routes before. The routes was like flying around. Nice. It's like one of the few ways to actually grind individual Pokemon. If you're trying to achieve that level parity. Ooh, it's a, a poultry geist or whatever they're called. A uh, poultry geist. No, that would be like a chicken ghost. Um, what's it called? I don't know. Alright, whatever. Doesn't matter. Yui's gonna F this guy up. Pokemon breeder Jamie. Usually the Pokemon breeders have like a rare Pokemon. Like somebody... Oh, never mind. Oh, I just can't get over this design. This design is so cool. Alright, so I don't know what typing this is. Do we know now? Steel? What? Uh, uh, okay. 
Well, I guess we'll send in uh, Armageddon. One shot you with the flame wheel. It's kind of weird that the trainer's Pokemon is a uh, lower level than the wild Pokemon we encountered just a bit ago. Intimidate is such a good ability, too. This is so nice. Alright, yeah, you just wasted a turn bringing us the parody. How does it feel? Hmm. This should one shot. It one shotted the. Oh! I'm surprised. The wild. I guess I had already hit the wild Pokemon a couple times. Because the wild Pokemon was level 16, I think. Alright, nice. Easy. Just got two more, though. So we gotta get Royal Trucks out fighting. Royal Truck is the, the lowest one right now. Um, none of these are that good. Uh, nah, I'm just gonna sweep. It's time for the Armageddon sweep. My dog is too strong. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, easy. Tackle, really? Alright. Oh, crit? Okay, not bad. Not bad. Feeling like, uh... Kurosawa with the ants up in here. Ooh, throwing on the potion, too! Dang. I should've just flame-wheeled again. Why am I being so PP conservative? PP conservative. <laughs> That, that definitely is sounds way too similar to the People's Party of Canada, the PPC, which is not a party that I am anywhere near supporting in any capacity. So I just wanted to clarify that <laughs> when I say maybe I should be more PPC. <laughs> That's the last, the last thing I mean. If anything, I should be much less PPC. And just spam the strongest move all the time and not worry about it. Ooh, I can get away with a bite here. I should just bite. Ah, uh, yes. Confusion indeed. As I have somehow conflated PowerPoints and People's Party of Canada. Uh... Okay. The Royal Truck's still level 16. So spooky. He just doesn't really have that much attack power. Ooh! Oh shit! Oh, this is exciting! I have no idea what Tenko is going to evolve into. Like, as I said, I did look through the Pokémon at one point, when I thought I wasn't going to play this game. But I didn't take it in very much. Alright, amazing design. Thievil. Uh, Swiper no swiping. The mustache is... I don't know. The, the personality that I projected onto Tenko when I gave her the name Tenko seems like it applies a little less here. Now it's kind of more suave and mysterious instead of like arrogant and mysterious. Smug and mysterious. There's still a smugness, but it's like a, I don't know, thief classic. I'm sure we can have room for a thief. That's really useful too. You can just uh, grab a... Uh, Held items and stuff. Um, we've, we're mostly a special attacker, so it's probably going to be weaker than Snarl in most cases. Um, I, I don't know. Home Claws is kind of cool. Let's get rid of Assurance. Assurance is just kind of annoying, especially since uh, Tenko goes so fast. I think we're mostly just going to be wanting to outspeed and Snarl. Alright, good fight, good fight. GF, GF. I, you, you what, say? I played and ate so much tasty- oh. So you're, like, not actually good at training. Let's, uh, fight this kid. Just like a Pichu, right? Yeah, very impressive. I, what I still don't get is where that Eevee kid came from. The Eevee kid that was just hanging out in, in camp. Very strange. Of course, you got the Pikachu. Pikachu with the, the actual voice sample. It's, uh, no surprise that Game Freak doesn't ever update the, uh, uh what should we do here? It doesn't update the, um, sound effects for all the Pokemon since, like, RBY. Only Pikachu gets special treatment. But I think that's fine. They're kind of iconic now. That's just how Pokemon sound. Ooh, Thunder Wave, nice. That's annoying. 
I'm probably... Uh... I'm gonna be swapping out for Royal Trucks after this anyway, so I guess it's fine. But yeah, getting hit by status moves, like... If you think of... Okay, this is, this is going into some weird territory, but... If you think that all of the enemy trainers, all the NPC trainers... Oh my god! Okay, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Poor, poor Yui. Oh my gosh. She just got murdered. That was so strong. Ah, so, okay, alright. So this is what I was gonna say. If you think of all the NPC trainers as this, like, collective entity that's trying to prevent you from winning the game, then spamming status moves is, like, far and away the best thing the vast majority of them can do, right? Like, they should strategize such that... Okay, phew. I wasn't actually sure if that would do all that much. So I think Pikachu's, like, pretty bulky in special defense. I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's like... This is the only impact they can really have, is to say, hey, set a status move, and then the next trainers can take advantage. Hey, well, that's convenient. That's sure. Uh, electric. Well, let's catch one of these guys, I guess. And I want to catch a Meowth, too. Pumpkaboo. What? What does this evolve into? Produce Geist or something? Yeah, you found my black glasses. You can just look at my face and how cool I am. Alright, so I'm pretty sure Snarl is gonna do a lot. It's super effective. Oh my god, paralyzed and confused. This could be rough. I should have maybe used Paralyzed Heal, I don't know. Come on, alright, alright, we, we proc both. Snarl doing pretty good work. The problem is now. Mmm, we can't headbutt, we can't tackle. Both of those are ineffective. Lick? It's gonna be quite a lot weaker. Will it be, like, significant enough? Should I just swap someone else in? Maybe we'll just swap someone else in. Here's what I'm thinking. We'll just send in... Oh, Yui's gone. Send in Tenko. Tenko's gonna kill with anything, too. Ah, this is tough, this is tough. How are we gonna catch this one? Um, I'm gonna try Licking, I guess. I'm pretty sure Lick won't kill. Oh, Razor Leaf, that's a strong attack. God damn, that is a strong attack. Oh, I might actually suicide from par Confusion, no! No! Oh my god, Royal Trucks. Twin Infinitives. Getting... Ugh. Hurting itself in Confusion because the Punk energy was too strong. This noise punk overload. Okay, so Peck will probably kill. I think Power Trip is so... It's just base stat 20. It's not stab. It is super effective. We'll try. Oh, I'm so scared it's gonna kill. All right, good, good. We could even do one more. It seems unnecessary though. Raphael is a pretty high level. Oh, but then it heals. How much is it gonna heal? Uh, I kinda wanna do another one, but then we're basically a parody. Like, they're just gonna keep healing. If I home claws once, I should pre I'm pretty sure Power Trip will kill. Uh, what to do, what to do? Impact and pluck. Good, good. Um, what's Power Trip again, I guess? I think it does net me some damage, so even after Leech Seed, we should be able to, to catch here. That's my hope, that's my hope. Uh, I don't know. I, I think so, I think so. Let's give it a try. What are we going to call this Pokemon? Ooh, gosh. Ah, oh, this is bad. Now I need to power trip again, almost certainly. We're like down one though, you know? Like we're gonna get seated here. I guess I should just swap out, because Leech Seed is really annoying when you're trying to catch. 
Yeah, it's just because Raphael's confused too. Who can we send in though? Uh, maybe Jeremy can branch poke and it's okay. I think all of this will kill. Probably Flame Wheel will kill. Probably Bite will kill. Jeremy might be the only thing that can actually fight without killing, which is kind of awkward. But I, I feel like Branch Poke should be so ineffective. Ooh, Shadow Sneak. That's a good move. That's like a priority move, isn't it? Man, Pumpkaboo seems strong. Maybe I should put Pumpkaboo in the party. I don't know who to take out, though. Oh my gosh, Confuser. So annoying. Please, Jeremy, don't hurt yourself. Very peep show canon, though, for Jeremy to get confused. All he wants to do is sit around and branch poke. I'm gonna try catching again. It seems, it seems like we just got unlucky last time. This seems like a, a fine time to catch. Okay, sweet. What? Oh, I never came up with a name, though. Hmm. 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 Hypnotize and control people in Pokemon to see it. Gosh, that sounds very powerful. Um, I, I think I'll just go with this. <laughs> yeah, I like it. I, I don't know. I just like it. Gourd. <laughs> it's just a gourd. <laughs> um, a hidden item. Wow, rare candy, powerful. Uh, let's go back and heal. <laughs> so sad, but so necessary. These electrics are super aggro. Running until dust. I really like that no one asked if we could or should. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's, uh, let's end this one here. And we'll, uh... Check out what's in the big city next episode. Or we can just be struggling with Route 4 all of next episode. Not gonna act like that isn't a possibility. So we'll see.